let's enjoy this beautiful trip of Vainad. If you are traveling to Vainad from Bangalore like me, then a road trip would be the best possible option. It's only a 5 hour drive and should be comfortable for most people. You pass through a lot of jungles, greenery, mountains and it's an absolute joy. First stop to explore was Karlad Lake and these are the ticket details. If you start researching about Wynad, you may find that there are a lot of waterfalls and lakes but not every waterfall and lake is worth visiting because they are always very crowded. Karlad Lake has a very beautiful location and is visited by very few people. It also has a few adventure activities for kids and adults which makes it perfect for everyone. The lake is very beautiful and you can do boating, kayaking and enjoy your time here. There are also paths to walk around the lake which is almost like a garden and there are water lilies everywhere. They look so adorable. The person who was rowing our boat was also very knowledgeable. He was telling facts about the lake and the entire area. Next stop was Banasura Sagar Dam, which is also one of the most popular spots of Vainad. The place gets really crowded and also extremely hot, so if you are planning to visit here, make sure you arrive early morning by 9 am. After getting your tickets, you have to do a short hike to reach the top of the dam. The dam is absolutely beautiful and quiet. There is also a separate section where you can do speed boating. Don't miss the speed boating at all because it is one of the most adventurous and beautiful rides ever. If you want, you can also do zip lining. Outside the area of dam, there are lots of things to just nibble around, coconut water, ice creams, shopping areas, etc. Next, I visited a tea garden that I saw on the way and I was also able to go inside the tea estate by taking the permission of the owners. These lush tea gardens are an absolutely beautiful sight to watch and experience.
Next, I visited an adventure park for zip lining. It was so much fun going over the tea gardens in the air like a free bird. After completing the zip line, I went back to the base location from where I started by walking through these beautiful tea gardens surrounding the villages and houses of the local people. You can also try several kinds of tea here. On your way back, don't forget to purchase banana chips for your friends and family. I hope you enjoyed this video and found this helpful. I will see you soon. Bye!